Okay, now let's start working on adding and subtracting radicals. And here we have 4 root 5 plus root 5. Right away we can actually add these guys because we have the same radical over here. We have the root 5 and the root 5. If they were different numbers inside the radical, we would not be able to add them. But they're both 5s, so that's okay. And we have plus root 5, and that's really just a 1 root 5. So 4 root 5 plus 1 root 5, well, 4 plus 1, just 5. 5 root 5. That's it. So all we have to do, if we have the same radical being added or subtracted, is that you combine the numbers. So in this case we're adding, so five, sorry, 4 plus 1, just 5, times root 5. What about over here? 7 root 3 minus 2 root 3. So what we're going to do is that because we have root 3 for both of them, we can combine the numbers. So 7 minus 2, just 5. So the answer is just 5 root 3, which is the same thing as just 5 times root 3. And we're done.